let's do it. First snow thread. It's not the first snow thread of the year, but the first snow thread of the uh, snow thread extravaganza. Christmas Eve snow threads. Chat. Wish everybody on YouTube Merry Christmas. There you go. Get your opportunity. It's Christmas Eve. I'm aiming to have these video, well, this video. I'm, I'm going to do the same as I did last year, where I do one video with all three snow threads in. One on each platform. Um, I'm aiming to have that up on the Sunday after this, so the 27th. But, uh, yeah, this is this is being recorded on Christmas Eve, so... Christmas Eve snow threads. One on every platform. PS4 first, then Xbox One, then PC. I think we did exactly the same thing last year. It wasn't Christmas Eve that we did them, I don't think, but I just happened to be streaming on Thursdays, and it's Christmas Eve today. Um, right, so new rules for this year. There are now four vehicles banned rather than three. The baller has been added to the banned vehicles list. I really need to learn the swim line, but I put in no effort to do so. So the 9F, the Sultan, the Infernus, and the Baller have all been banned from Snowfreds moving forward. Obviously we, we had the Sultan, the 9F, and the Infernus were banned because they are all-wheel drive super and sports cars. So basically they're quick and they're all-wheel drive, so they're OP in the snow. But the baller, I've decided that the baller is just as good as the Sultan. Uh, so the Sultan is the the baller is also banned. So it's really a case of now. Previously, you would always look for a baller, and that would be it, and you would be good. But now it really is a case of you either choose a fast rear wheel drive car, like a Fauxer or a Carbonizer or something that's gonna it's gonna be quick but it's going to struggle to get up Chiliad, especially in the snow. Or you can choose an all-wheel drive car, like a Stratum or another SUV, that is going to be slow, but should get up Chiliad much better. So it's interesting. It's going to be an interesting one to have the baller banned. It's, it's, been a, it's a bit of a change. Normally we would just go for the baller in these snow threads, and that's what you'd look for. If you see a baller, you're golden, but new this year. Let's mix it up a little bit. Yeah, there was a summer bark in the background. Uh, I have a, I have a beer. And I'm going to drink at every checkpoint. A little swig throughout all three snow threads, I guess. I don't know. I didn't really think it through. Let's have a dad joke. Here's one. Want to hear about good? Want to hear a joke about construction? Nah, I'm still working on it. He's a scumbag! He's an absolute scumbag! <sighs> wow, did people really turn their nose up at the Granger? Oh, oh. Damn it. I would have taken a Granger. Oh, he's hit him! Yeah, he's taken! <laughs> he pressed the wrong button, he ended up hitting the guy! Hope he didn't kill him because he's gonna have to wait for him if he did. No hitting anybody, no killing anybody. Those are in the rules, to be fair. All right, Penumbra. That's not a bad start. I was gonna, I was just like pulling out to to sort of wait um, for him to get in the car so I could kick him out, but then he ended up punching the guy, so <laughs> I just took the car instead. Yes, this is the, uh, the 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 regular Penumbra. This is the slower Penumbra. Did I ever tell you guys about the quicker Penumbra on Project Homecoming? It's much quicker and better to drive. It's really fun. This is not that. <laughs> he said the thing. I've already missed a drink, I've just realised. There's a checkpoint at the lighthouse that I didn't drink for. I don't normally drink alcohol. Like, very, very rarely. I figured since it's Christmas Eve and someone suggested it in the chat, I might as well. But, like, this probably will be enough to make me drunk. <laughs> Just one beer will be enough. 
Now talk about off-road traction lots. <laughs> Alright, I'll do my I'll, I'll do two drinks on the on the highway. So that I'm actually continually trying to do well. Good old snow friends. That was a good bit of fun. There we go. My drink of choice, Cronenberg, 1664. It's my preference. When I on the, on the very rare occasion that I do consume alcohol. To be fair, my absolute favourite alcohol is white wine, as those who watch the podcast will know. But uh, when it comes to beer, that's the one I choose. What are you doing? 1663 was a bad year. This penumbra really isn't the quicker penumbra, is it? I've lost a lot of speed. Is that a phoenix? Hmm. <sighs> Try Cronenberg Blanc if you get the chance. Oh, pretty good. I might take this buffalo, you know. Hope you're all settling in, by the way, for these Christmas Eve snow threads. Three snow threads back to back. Trying to get one on each platform. I feel like the Buffalo. This is a good, like, it's a solid car. It's like a solid G threading car. got decent traction. It is rear wheel drive, but I don't know how good it is in the snow, but it's got decent like straight line speed. I got the stream record last year in a Buffalo. Did you really add to X? Hmm. Maybe. Can it do the hot lap route? Should I risk it? I don't feel like risking it. Solid on the OG route though. Okay. So let's not let's not risk hot lap route. See this is the thing, this is the, the balance of a snow thread. Or a rainy thread if we use snow thread rules. You can have something that's slower like a stratum or a SUV. And try your luck at the hot lap route. And you'll probably make it if you've got a four-wheel drive car. But if you're in something faster, like a Buffalo or like a Carbon Air or something, it's suicide to do the hot lap route. So then you end up in the case of... Oh, God. All right, let's try that again. Uh, you end up in that, that sort of... Do I risk the hot lap route or do I take the... You know, Taking the OG route does take longer. So you are losing time there. Lots of explosions there. That didn't go well. Oh, come on! Stick to the right! I'm hammered already. Yeah, that's it. The drink's already taking effect. This buffalo has seen better days. I need to drink again because I, I got to the airport checkpoint. This is it. I'm. I, do you know what? I can already feel it. Actually, like a little bit of, a little bit of, you know, peppiness. <laughs> I don't drink very often, right? You know, this is this is just how it is. Can I? It's not like in my uni days when I used to have like bottles of wine per night. Not every night, but some nights. <sighs> Tell you what, the Picador. Could the Picador get up the hot lap route? Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> Listen, folks, he doesn't drink much and he's 90 pounds soaking wet. <laughs> the Picador's four wheel drive. It doesn't have much power, though, I suppose. RDT. I'm happy that you're here, RDT. to enjoy the snow threads on this Christmas Eve. I'm sure you'll be gone very shortly. This is where everybody who watches the YouTube videos on, on G threads are like, who is RDT? <laughs> if they don't watch the podcast, they've never seen anything from the olden era, old era of GTA content. Who's this guy? Who's he talking to right now? One of the classics. I tell you what, there's really not a lot of good cars around. I think the Buffalo might actually be the best car. Mine's pulling to the left. Oh, what a scumbag! I need to pace myself in more ways than one. This is the first of three G-Freds back to back. Let's just I mean I'm in a I'm in a top five I'm in a decent top five position and I accept that. Snowfred Demption Episode 3 on the main channel of G Freds when G Freds moved over to the main channel. That's still the greatest G Fred in my opinion. From from my perspective at least. Bollocks. Sip every time you fail. Well we do have the G Fred drinking game. That is a thing. It's in the description of all the YouTube videos. It's in the uh it's a is a as a Twitch chat command. Oh god. Oh god. Created by Askabini. And I did, I, I did initially think that maybe I should do the G Fred drinking game, whilst also driving in G Fred myself. But I think that maybe I'm better off saving that for like a special stream or something, because I'm gonna have trouble. That's one of those things where you you play the game and keep doing G Freds, and you just get gradually worse at the G Fred because you're getting more drunk, and then that means you have to drink more, and then there's more fails, and it's just a vicious cycle. Oh, what a scumbag! Tell you what, I'm catching up to the, the Thule. I'm not going to do top 5 finish the drink as some of you are suggesting, but if I win, if I win a G-Fred tonight, I'll finish the drink. How about that? Because it's been a while since I've uh, won a G-Fred. It's been a while since I've won a Snowfred. Snowfred Demption, I think, was my last Snowfred win two years ago. You gotta be careful here. The buffalo climbs well up Chiliad. In the snow. On the OG route at least. I shouldn't have said that, should I? It's gonna get terrible from here on out. <laughs> this has been a blur already. Like, I'm not even concentrating on what's happening. <laughs> I don't know how I've gotten to this point. How am I here on Chiliad? What happened in this race? G friends are kind of muscle memory. Yeah, that bit. just go on autopilot. why I can talk through G-Freds, but I can't talk when I'm doing iRacing races. <laughs> Let's try that again. Hey! 
There we go. Been a pretty solid third all the way through, really, since I got the buffalo. Despite me trying my best to trash it. Not many people coming for the hot lap route, it looks like. In terms of coming up it. Oh no, 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 oh no. Oh, the tree saved me. Thank you, tree. That was an explosion. That was on its way to being an explosion. 100%. Jesus, I forgot about Snow Freds and you just have absolutely no grip whatsoever. <laughs> Panic on. <laughs> I love the little message. At any point during the race you can respawn. It's like, you are doing so bad, let us remind you that you can respawn if you want. <laughs> you can have another, another go at this. I haven't drank yet but my uh, chili had checkpoint. Yeah, this buffalo has definitely seen better days. Looks like Diglett had some troubles on Chiliad, so I'm in a fight over second. First place looks like he's gone. Can't even see him on the map. I love snow in GTA. It's so much fun. Only comes around once a year. what makes it even more special. Well, I'm in a fight over second for life. Nobody else anywhere, in front or behind. Yeah, we had uh, we had snow uh, um, on April Fools this year. We did that special snow thread and the first round of MCC season six. <laughs> He's going for a car change. Interesting. Is that going to pay off? I feel like you lose so much time by changing cars at this point that you're not going to gain it back. I've always said that, but... Maybe he's going to go for the Hail Mary and he doesn't believe in the Buffalo's ability to get it done. I'm going to go for the Hail Mary as well. I don't know whether I believe in the buffalo's ability or not, but at this point I, I'm just going to see what happens. I've had a sip of beer, that's enough. Oh, there's my drink for the observatory checkpoint. Oh, what a scumbag! 
Did the uh, game cut out the yeah stupid old gato? <laughs> the leader gone for the Hail Mary or the regular parachute line? How far behind was he? 42 seconds, yeah. Hail Mary only saves you about 20. Can't beat that. But I'll still give it a good shot. You never know what might happen. I know what will happen. <laughs> I'll botch it completely. <laughs> go, 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 pull it, pull it, pull it. Oh, it wasn't perfect, but made it work just. Oh, it ripped Diglett. Diglett had caught me up in his faster car. But he couldn't execute the Hail Mary. He's gone. <laughs> oh. Can I make it to the island? I don't know whether I can. Yeah, I'm not finishing too far away though in the end. Moist Kitty takes the win, but it wasn't that far ahead. The Hail Mary actually made me a lot of time, especially if I'd have been able to execute it like 100% perfectly and actually um, being able to parachute all the way to the line. That might not have been too bad. I'll take that. First Snow Fred of the night, second for life, of course. Where else would it be? Second for life. Here's my drink for the finishing checkpoint. Thanks for the GG's. So I finished 23 seconds behind in the end. That was even after going into the sea and having to swim the last little bit. Yeah, that's a good point actually. The normal parachute line will be significantly slower in the snow because to get up the hill in the snow is going to take longer than like relatively to the to the Hail Mary line because you're on the road so that's a good point actually yeah the, the 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 difference between the Hail Mary and the regular parachute line is actually bigger in the snow that's good to know for the next 2G friends so it looks like Diggler after all that he he dies and he's still going to finish in third place so he ended up not losing a position after all of that <laughs> Because everybody else is having such issues, I think. Where is fourth? Alright, coming on... Oh, okay, they're all coming on the normal parachute line, I think. Diglett still manages to take third, despite the... Yeah, he got it on the second try. I suppose, yeah, he did the Hill Mary on the second try again, so you managed to get it, and that's what got you third again. If you'd done the regular parachute line, might not have been the case. And this guy, Gio Ferreira... He's fine. He's in last, I think. Let's see. He's finally getting himself up Chiliad. Oh, no, that didn't work. Oh, he's not fully last. McGregor's last. He's tried to get up Chiliad all this time. This is the G-Fred spirit. This is what the G-Fred spirit is all about. Oh, and he's gone. He gets the checkpoint and then slides straight back down. <laughs> Good old G-Fred spirit. Never giving up. Always keep going. Even though you know you're going to DNF, you keep going. I'll take a second. Second for life for the first one. Still got two to go. No, I haven't updated it on Xbox. I forgot completely about updating it. Oh my god! <laughs> I haven't been on since the heist DLC! Oh, for God's sake, man. 
Okay, so normally Xbox is second and PC is last. But I guess we're going to have to do it the other way around tonight. <laughs> I imagine this will be a little bit jarring in the video. Because we normally finish with PC. But now you're going to go from 30 FPS to 60 FPS and then back to 30 FPS again. Because we got to do Xbox last. That might be a little bit jarring on the eyes. All right, there we go. Let's uh, let's have a Christmas dad joke this time. More like 20 FPS for Xbox. Not anymore. Not now I've got the Xbox One X. Manages to hit 30 most of the time like the PS1 Pro does. Base PS4 and base Xbox One are definitely showing their age now. On this game and others. Never mess that up, damn it. Christmas cracker joke. What's the best Christmas present in the world? A broken drum. You just can't beat it. Ah, that is a that is a classic Christmas cracker joke. Are Christmas crackers anywhere in the UK anywhere in the world except the UK? Like do they exist? Are Christmas crackers a thing? Zexy had never experienced them. She's obviously from Sweden. Is it just a UK thing? There's my drink for the first checkpoint. I forgot about that. I've been drinking midway through the G-Freds. In Indonesia, yes. I'm going to have my first Christmas cracker experience tomorrow. They're good fun. Good old classic Christmas family fun. Makes a bang. And then you get to put on a little party hat. And you get a terrible joke and a terrible prize. Sometimes there's trivia, not jokes. Or charades. <laughs> You can get them in the US, but they're not really a tradition. Okay. Christmas crackers are basically... Uh, how do you even explain a Christmas cracker? It's like a... Um, I don't even know how you'd explain it. Wow, this Feltzer's. Nobody went for this Feltzer. Go, 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 go. No, I'm going to get taken from me. What a scumbag. Yes, he kicked him out. He got in a little bit too late. No, I've killed him. I'm going to have to wait for him. No. Bollocks. Oh, he said go. Okay, he said go, I'm free. I've been penalized enough. <laughs> Away we go in the Feltzer. Do you know what? I was so happy that I found a Feltzer immediately and nobody else went for it either. And the way that I got it, like, all three of them went for the other Feltzer. A Christmas cracker, a piece of cardboard that goes bang. Yeah, that's pretty much it.
But that's always the that's always the thing, you know. We we have that rule of if you kill somebody, you've got to wait for them because that's how it would be in a regular race. If you take somebody out of a race, if you you know crash into them or whatever, in just any normal race that we do, you've got to wait for them and give the position back. But it's always been the thing. If someone says go, if someone you know just says it's all right, just go, then you can go. <laughs> I got penalised a fair amount. I had to wait a good, what, 20 seconds there, maybe? He's got the trailer still on the back of that car. Tell you what, Feltzer, not a bad car to have. For a snow thread. Yeah. Obviously, it's not, I'm not going to do the hot lap route, but good traction. I don't think it gets much better than this if you're going to go for a rear-wheel drive fast car. As a reminder, I didn't actually say it before this G-Fred started, but as a reminder, no 9Fs, Feltzers, uh, Feltzers, no, no 9Fs, Infernuses, Sultans or Ballers are allowed if you see them. He's cheating. You guys in the chat always like have double standards. In any other race, when someone says just go, oh, what a scumbag. it's like, yeah, okay, never bat an eye on it. But as soon as someone says just go, when it's me at the start of a snow thread, you're like, wait, you should be waiting. The rule says to wait. Scumbags. You're all scumbags. Oh yeah, I haven't had a bit of I haven't had a drink yet for the quarry checkpoint. I'm using my leg for the throttle when I do that. There's a stratum there. There's a lot better car selection in this one than there was in the PS4 G for it. Course I There's even an Infernus is about. That's a Sultan I've just passed. Some good uh, good cars in this G-Fred. Even in a dry G-Fred, this would be a good selection. There's the, the felt of speed. Please have enough speed for it, please. Oh, just. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, yes. Miss all the nonsense from people coming down. the AI traffic. <laughs> oh, that didn't go as well as it could have done. <laughs> and there's my airport checkpoint drink. That was a bad airport checkpoint. I passed that asteroid on the way to the airport and I'm still only just ahead of it like that's that's how badly I've done I should have been much further ahead forty seconds behind the leader I wonder if the leader that's close is the person who won the battle over that Feltzer at the start All three of them went for the same car. Definitely not doing hot lap route. 
of all the rear wheel drive cars though, of all the rear wheel drive sports cars that you could possibly get in a G-Fred, the Feltzer has the best chance of doing the hot lap route. I just wouldn't want to test it in the middle of a snow thread. Oh, Hammer got the Feltzer, did he? Okay. Felter could make it up the hot lap route. It's not something I've ever tested, I don't think. From what I can remember, I don't think I've ever tried it. Just because when you're in when you're in the race, you don't want to try something like that. <laughs> Jesus! Wait for the AI. That's two people I've murdered on the highway. Second place has had issues. Stupid patriot. So I'm in a battle for second again. It seems to be a running theme so far in these G-Freds. Snow friends. Is a little bit too squirrely, I think, for the hot lap route in the snow thread. I mean, it's got good grip, the Feltzer. It's like got good base traction. But it's also got a lot of power, which doesn't help. Spin. The filter is a great car. Can you imagine that this car, it's one of the fastest sports cars in the game. I mean, it's not going to beat an Italia or a Pariah nowadays, but it's still bloody quick. It's only 145k. 145k, it's got some good customization options. It's fast. It's beautiful to drive. It's great to race with. Like, that's bloody cheap these days. First place has had issues. First place has had big issues. I'm coming. Oh, he hasn't even got the checkpoint yet either. Oh, I'm suddenly in a battle for the win. This battle for second has become a battle for first. Feltzer. It's the first time I've seen that that would pop up, even if it was just a nuance of where the checkpoint is. First time I've seen that in a G thread for a long time. I don't even remember the last time I won a G thread. In a long, long time. 
Not as long as it's been since I've last won a random all, though. <laughs> oh, don't tell me he's gone into the sawmill. Oh, he almost did. He actually managed to get out of it. Votes are on, votes are action. Your victory will be tainted with murder. Train! Hey, I have a completely clear conscience. He said go, so I went. I goed. Stratum cannot do the hot lap line. That's what I was wondering. Someone in the chat earlier said that the Stratum can do the hot lap line. A lot of those four-wheel drive, all-wheel drive cars, they don't have enough power to do it, so you've really got to have, like, the absolute best um, momentum all the way through. Like, you've got to be able to hold the momentum all the way through. It's, it's like, it's not a... It's not a, it's not a guarantee, I would say. Maybe the, uh, the thing is, like, it's a, it's a double-edged sword because if you ban the baller and there's no real viable option to do the hot lap line, you're just forcing everybody. The baller was really the only one that could do the hot lap line consistently. But then, because the baller can do the hot lap line, and it's so quick in general, the baller becomes the de facto number one. So it's like, do you ban the baller, have no car, be able to really do the hot lap line consistently? Oh, oh he's had issues again. And, uh, and have a more varied car selection approach, potential. Or do you allow the baller, but then it's just another case of everyone, if you get a baller, you, you, you've got the best car. I think. I think it's better to have more cars available. And you can risk the hot lap line in a stratum if you want. But there's no guarantee it's going to work perfectly. Sometimes it might, sometimes it won't. But it's going to be a challenge to get it to work. Not the right idea there. And then into a tree. I haven't um, had a drink for Chiliad or the observatory yet, have I? I don't think I should. Because I might have to down it. <laughs> What do I do now? This is a question. We're in a battle for the lead, battle for the win. Both in Feltzers. Which way do we go? This is so close. <laughs> Nicely done. I'm going to put him to the decision force his hand. Yep, he's gone Hail Mary too. So we're both going Hail Mary. Blimey, this is close. This is the closest it's been in a G Fred for a long time. about that. It's all about this execution. It's all down to the Hail Mary. I'm putting the chat on. <laughs> Here we go. No!
It was an absolute beaut of a launch. And then he decides to... I think... I don't think he managed it. The launch off the off the rock face was beautiful, and then for some reason he got out and just decided to flail about like a maniac. I might be chugging my drink. When was the last time I won a G Fred? It's been a while. It's been two years since I last won a Snow Fred, for God's sake. Yeah. <laughs> Takes the win. Oh, that was so close though. GG Norkley. That was really close. That was amazing how close that was right to the end. Beautiful. Alright, gotta do it, gotta finish it. I said I would. Did it? Xbox, <laughs> the Xbox G Fred's gonna go really well <laughs> after that. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, what have I done? <laughs> the old stream record was twenty one eleven. You took everything I had, you scum. Was the old stream record for Snow Fred twenty one eleven? I beat it by almost a minute. New stream record for Snow Fred. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, R2X. That was even with waiting at the start as well. Oscar with the Prime subscription. Crocs host. <laughs> I'm not laughing for any reason. There's, there's, not, there's nothing that I'm laughing about. It just hit me. It just hit me. The, the drink just hit me. <laughs> The drink just hit me. I just... Uh, <laughs> it just hit me right there. That was it. That was the moment. I haven't had much to eat today. And... That it's just... It's just got me right now. That's it. There it is. <laughs> so the Xbox G friend. The Xbox store friend's got... Not, oh my god. I'm gone. I'm gone. <laughs> Oh man. Shit. <laughs> I'm <am> genuinely. <laughs> Guys, I'm genuine. I'm genuinely. Genuinely a little bit drunk. Like, it, it, it's gone beyond tipsy at this point. <laughs> just because. Just because I downed the rest of that after the win, it's gone. It's gone beyond. <laughs> oh shit. I've had one beer and that's all it takes. I keep saying I don't drink very often anymore. It's not it's not like it was twelve years ago when I was at uni. Being tipsy is claiming that you're drunk. Being drunk is claiming that you're sober. Oh then maybe I'm just tipsy. Okay, if they that by that with those rules I'm just tipsy. I haven't had much to drink tonight. Listen, 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 listen. I haven't had much to drink tonight. To, to eat today. That's what I was going to say. I haven't had much to drink tonight either. <laughs> oh God. What am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> oh man. It's been, I've never really done a drunk stream, um, like ever in my history of doing streams on Twitch, I've never done a drunk stream. Maybe I need to, need to do it at some point, like a charity stream or something. I got the win though! I won! I've just disliked it. I accidentally disliked it. <laughs> I didn't mean to dislike G-Fred. 
<laughs> yes. G Fred win. <laughs> oh my god, what am I doing? We still got the Xbox Snow Fred to do. To be fair, I don't feel as 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 drunk as I did um after after the PC race. Like it hit me in that moment. Now obviously with like the 20 minutes it's taken to load up this race and get people in. I don't feel I don't feel as bad. So I think I think I'm I think I'm gonna be fine. You've had enough anyway. Why have I brought the phone up? I'm gonna be fine. Don't even worry about it. I got the parachute. Everything's gonna be fine. Are you rocking? Yeah. Now I've moved to saying that I'm not drunk. So I'm going to be, uh, that means I am drunk. Is that how it is? <laughs> so we're back to 30 FPS on the Xbox. One more snow thread for the year, for Christmas Eve. I'm not even drunk, I don't know what you guys are talking about. I'm gonna go swim line. I'm doing it. Let's go for it. Oh god. Oh die, you scum. See, this is why I never do the swim line. Okay, I'm a little bit, I'm a little bit behind. I should have gone for the regular line. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be absolutely fine. I've had second, I've had first, this race has to follow that pattern and be a zeroth. What what is what's a zeroth? What does that mean? Does that mean DNF? All right, dad joke. Christmas dad joke. What did some of the dog get for Christmas? And I born twelve. It's pretty bad. Let's have another dad joke. What do prisoners use to call each other? Cell phones. That's pretty bad too. I'm not accepting this. Here's another one. This morning I was wondering where the sun was, but then it dawned on me. <laughs> okay, that's what I, I, that made me laugh. I like that one. We already know that the buffalo is a good option. Oh, I was about to steal it as well. The dilettante is not a good option, but it's better than nothing. People are turning their nose up at it. I'll take it. I'm ahead of you lot. Losers! <laughs> I don't think I've ever said that in my life. I'm not drunk. I'm fine. You guys don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> this newfound confidence. What are you? Are you a Schwarzer? You are a Schwarzer. No, don't do... Okay, I did that a little bit too early. Oh, there's a buffalo behind. I should have gone for that. Just 
Excuse me! Oh my days. Oh my god. Oh no. Watch as a good little car. <laughs> Looks like everyone's drunk. That would be a reasonable assumption. That's just a normal stream race, to be fair. All right, we're on the road. We're on the road. We're on the road. <laughs> of course we're on the road. Where else would we be? We're on the way. I think I was trying to say that. <laughs> we're on our way. I'm fine. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm totally fine. I'm fine. This is fine. We're rocking. <laughs> Is the Schwarzer faster stock top speed wise than the Buffalo? I know the Buffalo is faster fully upgraded. I don't think it's worth changing for a Buffalo at this point though. Remember, Sultan 9F in fairness and baller are banned. Ruffy becomes a proper dad when he's drunk. We're rocking on the road. Loses. Oops. <laughs> I have been summoned to judge someone getting drunk over G Fred. I wish just I wish to just say that you have a bad influence to your younger audience. Askabini, you created the G Fred drinking game. You can't come in here and say that. <laughs> the creator of the G Fred drinking game can't say that. <laughs> oh wow, I wanted to go through the gap but I couldn't I couldn't have the grip. <laughs> Synchronize <laughs> Oh, I'm not making it up oh, the jump. A scumbag. There's no way I'm making it up the jump. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Nah. Nah. No! I knew I wasn't making it up the jump, and I did it anyway. 24th out of 24. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Keep going. Let's just keep going. G Fred Spirit. I was talking about the G Fred Spirit just at the end of the last G Fred. This is the G Fred Spirit. You, you experience hardships, you keep going. Oh my god. This is this is reminiscent of the uh, the original G Fred, the original Snow Fred with Tony from 2016. We keep on rocking. <laughs> zeroth. First, second, zeroth. This is it. I missed a buffalo. Is this a buffalo? Gimme. Gimme 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 gimme. No! Oh, what a scumbag! No! Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Oh my god, am I really choosing a fella? What the? <laughs> Is that the leader? <laughs> oh, Oracle. No, Buffalo. <laughs> that was the leader. <laughs> That's how far behind, behind I am. All right, this is gonna be fine. This is gonna be fine. So the top three are already going back up to Chilean. That's fine. This is the start of the comeback. This is it. I'm gonna not DNF in this race. He's a scumbag. He's an absolute scumbag. I'm, I'm telling you, this is this is gonna happen. I'm not DNFing. Are you ready? I'm so far back now. <laughs> What's DNF going to be? 12th. I need to finish 12th or higher to not DNF. <laughs> oh my god. Guys, I think I might DNF. Just putting it out there. From hero to zero. <laughs> if I don't DNF in this race, then I deserve something. Something positive. Not just downing another drink, because that's exactly what you would all say. Exactly. I've all, I just predicted you saying it, and you're already saying it. <laughs> Sobriety. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so far back. Oh, what a scumbag. I'm so far back even from 20... Oh, I'm in 20 sec second. I'm not even last. That's all right. We're getting there. We're getting there. <sighs> what was that traffic doing? Just drive where you want to drive. This isn't going to have enough speed for this, is it? Oh my God, don't tell me. I'm going to do this with less speed than I did with the Schwarzer. No. No, the Buffalo's got it. See, this is why you need a Buffalo. It's a good G-Fred car. It's alright. It's alright. We're doing alright. We're in 20th. We're doing good. Just another 8 places. Where's 12th? 12th is 4 minutes ahead. <laughs> okay, I might DNF. I might just DNF. I'm 4 minutes behind. Even just not DNFing. This g thread is basically 2020 in a nutshell. <laughs> Actually... This is the final G thread of 2020, isn't it? It's just hit me. What a way to go out. Get a win and then this. <laughs> Come on. Come on, we can do this. Come on, little buffalo. I believe.
I mean, at least I'm not last. I'm still better doing better than four other people. Tree friend is a tricky mistress. What's the phrase? There's a phrase to do with mistress. Harsh mistress? Cruel? Cruel mistress, there it is. That's the one I was looking for. Thank you, chat. No Fred doubly so. This is karma for the last race you made her a scum. I don't accept that. My conscience is clear. Man, this drive is so long and lonely. The hot lap route is so much more interesting. Actually, stuff to do. I've done that again. I did that in the PS4 race. I managed to remember about it for the PC race, and then I've done it again for the Xbox race. Saved it. Oh, someone's on the left. Oh, he was. I'm sure he was in second. He's had an absolute chibi ad disaster. He was in second place. See, this is what I keep saying. G Fred is a cruel mistress. And I totally didn't need to the, the chat to remind me about that phrase. No, Fred is a doubly cruel mistress. How am I 16th? How am I 16th? Oh my god, people are having all the issues on Chiliad. I wonder if people get caught out by the uh, section that always catches you out. This bit. You gotta be careful. Car left, random left, left stranded. So we got a prediction running. Is it about whether, whether our DNF or not? In the Twitch chat, and only twenty-five people bet on me to not DNF. Oh, it's a dog. Oh, it's a dog. There's a dog by my feet. She's very excited. Been whining. <laughs> She's just not stopping whining. <laughs> well, here she is. Okay. RCD online is running. He's running. <laughs> Summer was missing me. I guess. Hello. She's licking my elbow. Can you? I'm trying to. Summer, do you not understand what Snowfred is? He's a scumbag! He's an Get it, yes! Scumbag. <laughs> He's gone! He's gone! Took the speed up and took the speed right back down again. I'm in 12th! told y'all. Y'all? Did I just say y'all? <laughs> oh god, that's not gone well. That's not gone well. I tell you what, top 10. Is top 10 possible? <laughs> I 
gonna, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm leaning into it. I told y'all, I told y'all, not too long ago, I'm gonna not DNF this race. Only 25 of you seemingly believe me. Scum. How far am I back from... I'm still about five minutes back from the leader. I was four minutes down on 12th place. After one checkpoint difference, I'm in 11th. <laughs> People have had major issues on Shitty <laughs> Summer's just laying by the door. Mr. Darkseid's already finished. Mr. Darkseid would have taken r 2 xdjs stream record with that run if I hadn't just done what I did on the PC version. GG. Thanks for crashing into me midway through the race. So these have been the first two sub 21 minute snow threads in history. We've seen two of them tonight. R2X DJ died. Where was my shoe def? Rip R2X. <laughs> Did not get his shoe. See, this is what G-Fred Spirit is all about. There's so many people who would have quit out after dying at the airport. G-Fred Spirit, you keep going. Look at me now. Never give up. drunk enough G Fred Spirit tonight. I'm not checking my parachute. It, it's a good suggestion to those who've suggested it in the chat. It is a very good suggestion and it's probably something that under normal circumstances I should do. But not today. Today we live life on the edge. It's the finals G Fred of 2020. Let's, let's have a bit of, uh, I don't know, there's, there's a word that would go on there. <laughs> it's something a sober Gruffy would do. Well, yeah, probably. Or a Gruffy that was actually going for a higher position. I've, I, th I think I've panic horned in every oh, single snow thread back. tonight. All three, I've had at least one panic horn. I'm going to lean into it as well. I'm going to go for the Hail Mary. Three, three out of three. I'm going for it. Not knowing whether I've got the parachute after that death. Oh, what a scumbag! And it's going to be glorious. Whatever happens, it's going to be glorious. Cops are outside Sankudo with a breath of life. He's a ballsy drunk. <laughs> this, this, this buffalo really has seen better days. It is struggling. Oh my god, it's a buffalo wedge. I think I'm going to fail this Hail Mary and not have a parachute to go with it, just to add to the misery. I think that's how this ends. <laughs> 
botched it. I didn't have a parachute! I didn't have a parachute! <gasps> Come on! <laughs> yes! Wow! Wow! It didn't realise that I had a parachute, but I managed to save it just in time. Look at this! Look at this! We're gonna get sixth! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> yes! Yes, someone wants to celebrate with me too. Yes! Sixth place hype! After that... <laughs> He gets such a huge boost from... <laughs> All you guys who bet the, the channel points and the prediction on me not even making it to a not DNF. Top six after that. Oh my god, that Hail Mary was an absolute... That was majestic. What a way to end 2020, G friends. <laughs> yeah. Oh my days. Beautiful. <laughs> then when the when the parachute it looked like I didn't have the parachute. And then it appeared and I had to pull it and, and do what I needed to do to make it and I even still made it to the island. That was that was one hell of a G friend. This has been a good Snow Fred extravaganza of, of three Snow Freds in one. This has been a good one. What a what a it's all Snow Freds always bring out the best. <laughs> Ten you bitch. These have been some very good G Freds. I even had three and a half minutes in hand to not DNF. I was still three and a half minutes to the good. What a what a what a way to end the G Freds for twenty twenty.